would y'all look at this? Look at this. What do you see? I see partly cloudy skies. Okay? I actually had to leave where I was at, y'all. I had to leave. I wasn't getting no... I, I was only getting like 12, 13 watts of input uh, for my solar on top because it was so cloudy. I wasn't getting any input and my battery my van power's power station was at 33 percent so and i look on the ma on the weather thing and i'm like okay it's supposed to rain all day it said this is one thing look at this look at that the sun is out this is one thing about missouri y'all i call this state bipolar state because they say it's gonna do something and then it does something else, whatever. But I decided to head closer to the city like I should have did in the first place um, because in case I do need to recharge my battery. What I think I am going to do though is I am going to take some of this stuff out of my freezer and put it in my mom's freezer um, and turn the freezer off because it does use more power in refrigeration mode. And, you know, I'm, I'm going by the weather app. It's supposed to be cloudy. So I know I'm not going to get nearly as much input um, as, it, as I would on a sunny day. So that's what I'm doing right now. Um, I'm going to go recharge my van powers at my mom's house and use her freezer. She don't mind. <laughs> use her freezer. And I am going to uh, stay close to the city. Yeah. Do some city stealthing. Just so that in case um, I'm just not getting enough sun. But <laughs> the sun is out. But I'm sure it's not going to be enough to take me to a hundred percent so that's what we're doing so I left the campsite and we're moving on to plan B is be in the city all right guys I am done at my mom's uh, it took a few hours to recharge my van powers and to recharge my Jackery to both of them are at 100 percent now let me tell you something it is not raining. <laughs> Look, it is not raining out here. The, the streets are dry. I don't know. Missouri, if you live in Missouri, this always happens. So, but they're still projecting rain and actually they are projecting floods because of the amount of rain that we are supposed to be getting. So I'm kind of glad I headed back to the city. That way for sure, I won't get stranded in an area if there is a flood somewhere. So that's why in van life, guys, it's always important to pay attention to the weather, okay? Because you don't want to get yourself caught in a situation and you can't get out of. So I'm kind of glad I came back to the city. But now that I'm recharged, I took some of my freezer stuff, guys, and uh, my mom allowed me to put it in her freezer that way. I changed my set power fridge to all refrigeration, no freezer mode, in order to, you know, <laughs> save some power, you know, not use as much. I should be good, <laughs> okay? So I think tonight, you guys, I am gonna head to a Crackle Barrel, okay? I am driving now to a Crackle Barrel. It's about 5.35 and uh, yeah. And I think that's just where I'm gonna rest up, you know, uh, for the day. Man life in my city to me is boring as, mm. <laughs> it is. But I, I do love the fact that I have my family here. 
It's not that I really get lonely. I'm just a family oriented person, period. So there's just no excuse. I love my family. <laughs> so I am always going to be there for my family. So yeah, anyways. Yeah, so I'm headed to Crackle Barrel for the night. And yeah, so I'll see you at Crackle Barrel. All right, guys. I made it to Crackle Barrel and I'm in the back parking lot and yeah this is where I'll be for tonight <laughs> and guys hold on let me turn this around I'm trying to get some light from outside can y'all see me <laughs> oh yeah so it didn't rain at all today maybe a little bit this morning that's about it it didn't rain <laughs> So I'm just like, wow. And every time I look at the weather app, the start of the rain gets pushed back an hour. So I don't know what the weather is going to do. Good morning, sunshines. How y'all doing today? It's the next day, okay? <laughs> and the ground is wet, but guys, I don't ever remember it raining. I must have slept through it. Anywho... Um, we're going to start the day today. I think we're going to go see some wildlife. Um, I've been to this park once before years ago. I took my stepson there and he really liked it. Um, so we're going to go back and we're going to be able to see some elks, some bisons, some deers, which we see all the time. But we're just going to go through. It's um, Lone Elk Park. It's in a Valley Park in Missouri. And you can drive through it. Um, it's a drive-through park because you can't get out of your car. But I remember the last time I was there, we were so close to the elks and the bisons. It was just wow. So... It's early in the morning, and we're going to drive through there, guys, and take a look and see what we see who's out this morning. They should be out and active this morning since it is early morning. So let's go. There's three of them. These are elks. <laughs> They're so close to me. <laughs> This is a free park. Donations are accepted. <sighs> and like I said, you just drive around and you should be able to see the animals. I see something up there. Guys, look at the elk in the road. There's four over there, and there's one right in the road. Oh my goodness, there's a whole bunch down there. Look, guys. <laughs> there's a deer. <clears throat> well, that elk ain't moving. He's stubborn. Hold on, y'all. That elk okay, ain't moving. He's stubborn. Get out the road so we can go. We just wait. Let's take a look over here. I knew they would be active this morning. 
for breakfast. Oh boy, here comes his homeboys. His homeboys are coming, y'all. Cars do not scare elks, I'm telling you. <laughs> that elk is not moving. We can't get through. Oh, Lord. Oh, what is he gonna, he's gonna try to drive past them? Oh my goodness. What is going on up here, y'all? Okay, his homeboy came up, moved out the way. Hopefully the other dude will move. You stubborn. You are stubborn. Thank you. Thank you so much. Mosey on, and I gotta drive past you. Hopefully, I will be all right. Don't attack my car, please. <laughs> please don't attack my car. Drive slow. I drive real slow. I'm no threat. Abi Abinye is no threat, y'all. Okay. Hi, honey. I know you're looking at me. Okay. Go ahead, boo-boo. Go ahead. Go across the street. Okay, now I wait. Keep going. two more. There's one right there. Another one right there. Oop. You, 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 y'all, y'all coming? Y'all coming? which is up here past these yellow gates. And once again, don't feed the animals, duh. Okay, let's drive and see if we can see some bisons. You can actually come up here guys and have a picnic with your family. They got benches and grills. Ooh, look what we got up here, y'all. There they are. There's a herd of bisons. Oh my goodness. A lot of them. Oh my goodness. That's y'all having a family reunion. What y'all cooking on the grill? Look at him. Bison area. Remain in the vehicle. You best believe, honey. I show you. 
but I shall take a look at y'all. They having a family reunion, y'all. He's standing, he's sleeping. He was like coming, baby. Hi. He scared me for a minute, y'all. I thought he was coming. <laughs> hey. Don't be sniffing her butt. They're so big. some elks in the distance. You see them? You see them? There's three of them. There's two standing up and one laying down that I can see. how close they are and they really just be minding their business well, I guess as long as you mind your business they gonna mind their business <laughs> that was kind of cool I think so anyhow that's how I started my morning now guys <laughs> you know I need to now uh, go post up somewhere and get my laptop out and pay some bills right quick and i normally don't like going downtown st louis but i think that's where i may go i'm not sure okay uh yeah so i'm gonna just drive and figure it out okay <laughs> got those brick stone cobblestone roads Brickstone roads, brick roads, I don't know what you call them. But I'm down here by the landing, and it's been a long time since I've been down here. But it looks like they have it all blocked off. You used to be able to get down there by the Mississippi River, but it looks like it's all blocked off. So you can't get down there anymore. Boo -hoo. Well, I'm not chilling down here. Let me get my butt up out of here. You can take that way up to the arch. Here comes the rain <laughs> that was supposed to be here yesterday. Here comes the rain. Wow. And it's only 10, 12 in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. It's still in the morning. It's not even noon yet. But 
I do got some things I need to take care of. Got some bills to pay. And I think I got some papers to submit to the court, whatever. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna take care of that. And thank you for spending the morning with me, guys. And I hope you enjoyed the video. And you already know what to do. I ain't gotta tell you. If you like my content, go ahead and subscribe and stick around, you know what I'm saying? So uh, yeah, so I'll catch you on the next video and travel safely, live your joy. And I'll see you on the next video. Shalom.